surprise for a few days. As you saw in the video and heard in Kevin's earlier remarks, today is Kevin's last annual meeting, serving as our CEO for almost 24 years. Kevin, we'd like to take this time to say thank you for all that you've done for the RMC. Kevin, I want to say how much I admire your dedication to our employees, our members, and this cooperative. When Kevin arrived at SCI in 1989, we had 22,000 members. Today we have over 33,400 members, making us the largest member-owned cooperative in the state of Indiana. Kevin has been an integral part of our growth and progress over the years. He has helped establish the SCI RMC as one of the most respected cooperatives in the country. You know they say that behind every successful man there is a woman. That woman is Kevin's wife, Lisa. Lisa, would you stand up and be recognized? Our wish for Kevin and Lisa is that retirement will provide them lots of time to kick back and pursue new dreams for many years to come. And I know I speak for the directors and all of our employees when I say that it's a bittersweet moment. Saying goodbye to a friend and co-worker who has meant so much to all of us is difficult. But remember, Kevin, you still have a few months left until your actual retirement in January. And I'm planning to take advantage of all that time continuing to pick your brain so that I'm better equipped to lead the cooperative in the future. It's impossible to list all the accomplishments for Kevin during his career over the last 24 years at SCI. But with the aid of our board of directors, we have come up with our top 10 list, kind of a David Letterman thing. Now this was difficult because there were so many things that it was hard to narrow down to 10. But we think we got the 10 best items. Uh, so this is going to be a little awkward here because it's kind of crowded up here. But uh, So hopefully this will work out pretty well. So just give me a second here. So, again, the, read my notes. The top 10 list of the highlights of Kevin's career at South Central Indiana, starting with number 10, Al Taylor. Uh, Kevin helped establish the Morgan County Economic Development Corporation. Great. Number nine. Kevin was a major force in the creation of the Circle City Group, a group of five REMCs that work together to educate the general public on how rural electric cooperatives are different from other utilities. Number eight. Kevin was the original member of the Touchstone Energy and served as board of directors. Number seven. Kevin was named Martinsville Business Man of the Year not once but twice in the, by the Chamber of Commerce in 1992 and 2003. Thank you. Number six. Kevin played a big part in supporting the automatic meter reading system. Thank you, Kevin. Number five. Kevin helped to create SCI LLC, a subsidiary that offers additional services that rural members are often denied by large corporations. Number four. Kevin brought vegetation management in-house, saving the co-op hundreds of thousands of dollars each year and improving our tree trimming results. Number three. Kevin pushed for 24 hour dispatch center to reduce the time it takes to restore power following the outage. Number two. Kevin helped to establish our Operation Roundup program in 1995, which has awarded more than $2.3 million in grants to charitable organizations in our seven county service area. And the number one highlight of Kevin Sump's career at South Central Indiana REMC. 
Kevin has dedicated the last 40 years of serving the electric co-op industry both in Iowa and Indiana and for the past 24 years he's led our organization uh, and he started as a, man, uh, a work order clerk in 1972 uh, to then become uh, CEO. Thank you Kevin.